Now, our weekly commentary, Steel Resolve. Here's Sarah Steelman. Thanks, Kevin. For those of you who have been around two-year-olds, you know that they are very me-oriented. Some experts call it the terrible twos. They throw temper tantrums when they don't get their way, and everything is me, me, me. It appears our country is going through a bad bout of the terrible twos. The media and the talking heads constantly report and editorialize about the next protected class and the so-called injustices they have suffered, and then they demand that the government provide some kind of service at taxpayer expense to fix it or some new regulation or law. The political process produces politicians that are only concerned with preserving their self-interest. All I hear is me first, mine, me, 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 just like a little two-year-old. But the little two-year-old doesn't know better. We do. The most recent and blatant example is Bradley Manning preparing to file a lawsuit demanding that he receive hormone therapy so he can become a woman paid for by taxpayers. You know, the real tragic injustice was the young Oklahoma baseball player who was murdered in cold blood by three selfish teenage boys who were bored. We are rapidly becoming a nation of self-absorbed egos preoccupied with demanding their so-called rights and fulfilling their so-called needs. Our nation was built and preserved on the unselfish nature of the American people, not self-centered two-year-olds. The Tocqueville remarked about our country that we are great because we are good, and when America ceases to be good, it will no longer be great. This is Sarah Steelman for Serenet Radio. Tune in again next week for another segment of Steel Resolve right here on the Palin Update.